guys, it is Kays bringing you a brand new video. And today, I'm going to be bringing you a first look to the brand new DLC 2 Eclipse Verge. So, let's hop straight into it. Alright, as you guys can tell, I have some gameplay up on the background. And I'm just going to be giving you a full-on thoughts of me, like my opinions on the map, and what I think about it. So first thing that popped to my eye on Verge, it's more of a deserty type look. And if you guys don't know, Verge is actually a remake from the World at War map Bonsai. So they try to make it kind of similar to that. There's a part on the map, it's actually a bridge. They have that on Bonsai um, in World at War. And the thing about this one is that since they implemented wall running and all that, you can actually do a lot more on that. Like let's say you fall off the bridge you can actually jump back up on it because of all the new movements they have now lots of people have been talking about this and i do believe this myself verge actually has really really great detail on this map like this is the most detailed map i've seen in forever in call of duty so i really do think that's a great step ahead putting more detail and focus on the little things on the map but people do notice it no matter how little they are now in my opinion verge is not my favorite map out of this whole dlc2 eclipse um i definitely do like maps like knockout better than this um, but Verge is that map where DLC 2 is kind of based around this long range kind of gun fights. You know, it's not really a short map. You know, you're going to be running a lot. You're going to be using your movement. So if you guys are that player that like the small maps, DLC 2 is not going to be like that. But trust me, you're going to have a ton of fun with it. So I will at least try it out because it definitely is a very, very fun map to play. With that being said, there are very pros and cons about this map. Some pros once again the detail there's more water implemented to the map so to go to certain places you actually need to go through the water you're gonna see a lot of gunfights down there which is gonna be really really fun because black ops 3 added that you can go on water you can actually shoot people in it and stuff like that some cons and this is probably different for you because um, I do this is my opinion for this but I feel like the map is very bland it's got detail but if you get where I'm coming from the sense that it's a very bland map um it's just not my favorite due to i'm not a fan of maps like this deserty maps i'm more of a fan of high tech maps such as another map that i'll be covering later on um one of the four maps is really high tech which i love that map so that's why it's not my favorite map but if you're that old school call of duty player this might be the map for you because it definitely does bring you back to the past and shows you a little bit about what call of duty used to be and what it is now now implementing the new movements. Yeah, so that's basically my wrap up of the whole map Verge and Call of Duty Black Ops 3 multiplayer DLC number 2 Eclipse. So if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you smash that like button down below. I really do appreciate it. Hit that subscribe button if you want to see more from me. I'm going to be covering one other map today then i'm gonna have the two others tomorrow so stay tuned for that i hope you guys are enjoying dlc 2 if you guys stay to the end of the video down in the comments i want you guys to comment your favorite map put my fave map is or my favorite map is that way i know today's video let's aim for 65 likes if we can hit that that'd be really really incredible we are about to 1.4k as i'm recording this video thank you guys way so much i just uh, thank you thank you thank you so, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys have a great day. Um, and you've been YouTube. I've been Kays. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out. Come on, let it go.